Praise the living God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory, 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 hallelujah to the Lamb of God. This is the day that the Lord has made you and I. We will rejoice and be glad in it in Jesus' name. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy, he's mighty, he's excellent, wonderful Jehovah. Excellent Jehovah, great Jehovah. We bless the name of the Lord. I welcome you all, my beloved sisters and brothers. May the Lord bless you all worldwide. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. Glory. Glory, 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 hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lamb of God, hallelujah, 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 amen. I would like to have a word of prayer. Oh, Heavenly Father, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the ancients of days. Oh, Lord, my Father, oh, Lord, my God, we thank you, everlasting Father, for your being with us, for your waking us up to see another beautiful day. Oh, Lord, my Father, thank you, Lord. No other God is like you. No other gods to compare to you are the most high God. Lord, I'm going to thank you, Father, going to bless you, Father, going to worship you, Lord. Thank you, everlasting Father, for your giving me the privilege, Almighty God, to go to the world. Oh, my God, I preach your good news, Almighty God, and I am so grateful, Lord. I am so thankful in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, my Lord. And as we come right now, mighty God, I shout out you, our healer. And almighty God, there is nothing I have for you to, to you to, for, there is nothing I have for you to do, almighty God. We bless your holy name in the name of Jesus Christ, my Lord. Holy Spirit of God, I welcome you now. Miss, come and have your way in Jesus' name. Holy Spirit of God, has we, we every son, every daughter that's sick right in the hospital at home, heal them in the name of Jesus Christ, and give them spirit recovery in Jesus' name. Oh, Father God, almighty God, I cover myself, my, my Myself with the blood, I cover each and every one of all with the precious blood of Jessica, my family with the precious blood of Jessica. Oh Lord, my Father, in any way that you are sinning against you, I plead for your mercy, wash us, cleanse us, and purify us, oh Lord. I cover myself with the blood of Jessica, I cover each and every one of us with the precious blood of the Lamb of God. And I gotta thank you for your precious blood of Jesus Christ. You are worthy, you are mighty, you are excellent, you are wonderful. Thank you, everlasting Father. Thank you, everlasting God. Take all the glory, take all the honor, take all the praise, and I hand over everything unto you, Lord. Any power, any spirit, any power personality that want to attack me spiritually physically that want to attack your children and I let your thunder fire arise and consume those power father we ask you father in Jesus mighty name I have prayed amen hallelujah hallelujah to the Lamb of God I bless you all in Jesus name amen hallelujah I would like to sing to the glory of God if you don't know the song Song, just follow me. Let us glorify our God. Let us bless His holy name. His worthy, His mighty, His excellent, His wonderful, mighty Jehovah, excellent Jehovah, great Jehovah. We bless His holy name in Jesus' name. Amen. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. Oh, it's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Oh, glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. Glorify the Lord with me. It's all the name of Jesus. You deserve a very big thank you. 
Oh, yeah, this love, a very big thank you, a very big thank you, my Lord, thank you, my Lord. Oh, yeah, this love, a very big thank you, you deserve a very big thank you, my Lord. Oh, yeah, this love, a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Father God, thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Lord. You deserve a very big thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Papa God, thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Daddy me. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Papa God, thank you, my Lord. Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Daddy me. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Papa God. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Father God. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Papa God. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Papa God. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Father God. Thank you, my Lord. You are my heart where I cannot see. You are my heart when I have no hands, Lord. You are my ears when I cannot hear. Oh, I am see. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Papa God. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you. A very big thank you, Papa God. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you. A very big thank you, Father God. Thank you, my Lord. You are my eyes where I cannot see. You are my hands when I have no hands, Lord. You are my you are my ears where I cannot hear. Oh, I am see. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Daddy. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Papa God. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Lord. A very big thank you, Father God. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Papa God. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you. A very big thank you, Father God. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you are my eyes where I cannot see. You are my hands when I have no hands, Lord. You are my ear where I cannot where. When I cannot hear, oh, I am see. Thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, my Lord. Oh, you deserve a very big thank you, a very big thank you, Papa God. Thank you, my Lord. Praise the living God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless as the name of the Lord, His Word is mighty, His excellent, is wonderful. I'm our Father, Almighty God. He deserves a very big thank you from you, from me, to say thank you to Him for what He's doing in our life. We bless the name of the Lord. There's many people that went to bed last night. They taught many things. They planned, they planned the many things to do today. But their today didn't come. It's not because you and I, we, we, we are better than them. It's not because you and I are doing good things than them that make you and I to see today. It's just because of the grace of God. He said, according to his word, I will show mercy to whom I want to show mercy to. I will show compassion to whom I want to show compassion to. Our God is a compassionate God. Our God is a God of love. God that pitied his children that fears him. Praise Master Jesus. I bless the name of the Lord and I thank God for your life. I thank God for your family's life. 
for waking you up, waking everyone of us up to see another blessed for day. Beloved, I come to pray for you. Anyone that is sick in a hospital at home, please, I come to pray for you. Please, don't see me, see Jesus Christ. See, Jesus Christ is with you in your bedroom, in the, we are in the, in, if, if, if you are home or in the hospital, Jesus Christ is there with you. Jesus Christ, that he, 2,000 years ago, is seeing, is seeing the same business, healing his children till today. He's sending, he's, sending, he's sending his servants out to go out there and pray for his children. Because he wants you to be well. He wants you to be whole. Praise Master Jesus. Wherever you are, please. If you are sick, please, I want you to release your faith. I want you to believe that this sickness will go today. Believe Jesus Christ will touch you today. This sickness will leave you today. In the name of Jesus Christ. All you have to do. Receive your healing by faith. Believe in him. Trust in him. He is our healer. By the stress of Jesus, we, we are healed. Praise Master Jesus. Before I start praying for you, receive your healing. And I, I believe and I know, oh my God, his healing rain is showering where you are right now. All you have to do, just believe, and that healing rain we wash you. We wash those sickness and disease away from you in the name of Jesus Christ. Children of God, we live by faith, not by sight. Because anyone that comes to Father God must believe that he is the God of faith. You, you and I cannot receive anything from him without faith. We need faith. You need faith. Even though your faith is late you, please stretch it out and touch the border of his cement and the border of his garment. Touch him. He's our healer. He's here to heal you. He sent me to come and pray for you. Please touch him. I will use the I will read the word of the Lord to encourage you. He is the one that healeth. God is the one that healeth. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. My sisters, my brother, wherever you are, please, as you are listening to this message, please. If you can share this message, it will be good to be a blessing to others. May the Lord bless you. God will reward you for it. You are doing the work of God, not for, not, not for me. You are doing it for Jesus. He will reward you for it in Jesus' name. Please, you can share this message to reach a people out there for the glory of God. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Amen. I will read the word of the Lord to encourage you. God Almighty wants you to be well, my sisters, my brother, wherever you are in the hospital. I will read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Praise Master Jesus. Stretch your faith out. The book of uh, Jeremiah. The book of Jeremiah chapter 8, verse 22. Hallelujah. Glory. Hallelujah. The book of Jeremiah 28, um, chapter 8. Verse 22, I read in Jesus' name. Is there no balm in a Gilead? Is there no physician there? Why then is not the health of the daughter of my people recovered? Praise Master Jesus. The word of the Lord is asking. Is there, is there, the word of the Lord is that, is there no balm in Gilead? Is there no balm in Gilead? Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. The blood of Jesus Christ. The blood of the Lamb of God is the balm of Gilead. That is the balm of Gilead, the blood of Jesus Christ. As the word, as the Father Lord Jesus Christ has died for you and I. He shed his special blood for you and I. 
Praise Master Jesus. To rescue you, to rescue me. That by the stripes of Jesus Christ, the children of God, we are we we are hid. Praise Master Jesus. The, 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 the word of the Lord is asking, is there no bomb in Gilead? Oh, is there no physician there? Lord Jesus Christ sent all his sons, all his daughters. The physician is the, the physician is the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit is here. I said the word of God is coming. Is the one that will give you that grace so to stretch your faith out. Our healer, the blood of Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus Christ heals. The blood of Jesus Christ saves the precious blood of the Lamb of God. The word of the Lord ask him, is there no bomb in Gilead? No physician there? Papa God wants to heal you. Lord Jesus wants to heal you. There is bomb in Gilead. Jesus Christ. The blood of Jesus Christ. He wants to purge it that your sickness away from you. He wants to use, he wants to wash those sickness and diseases away from you. He wants you to stand up and do what you couldn't do before. Lie down there crying. Going through that pain is not his wish. Please don't say, because I've seen. Because I've seen now you are talking about Jesus. This Jesus will not hear me because I have sinned against him. No. It is goodness that will bring you to repentance. It is goodness that will make you to think to and say, Ah, this man did this to me. When I hurt him so much, he still bless me, still bless me with, with good health. He still hear me, send somebody to come and pray for me. It is goodness that will bring you to repent and say, Father God, I, I repent. I want to live for you. He loves you. Lord Jesus Christ lives on this earth. The time he lived on this earth, he hid. Many people were hid that believe. Many were sick that they brought to him. Not all of them were hid. Because why? Because they didn't have faith. The one that didn't hear, they didn't have faith. The one that got their healing, they got their healing and they were make, they make they were made whole. Don't just let me heal, they were made perfectly whole because they believe in him. I want you to release your faith to touch Master Jesus, the bomb in Gilead. I want to touch, I want you to, to, to touch him by faith, Lord Jesus. The Holy Spirit is there with you. Where you are right now, Holy Spirit is there. It's because of the Holy Spirit is here on this earth for all the children of God to be a helper to us. Praise Master Jesus. He will help you. All you have to, 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 to do, stretch your faith out. I came to encourage you and I'm encouraging you right now with the word of the Lord. Please have faith. Please don't doubt. You shouldn't doubt. Because when you doubt, the healing will pass you by. Because the one that doubts will not receive anything from the Almighty God. Praise Master Jesus. We not receive anything from Almighty God. You are not. We must have faith. Even though your faith is not more, if it's not, it's not big, even though it's small, according to the word of the Lord. Lord Jesus Christ said it to us in his word. Even though your faith is small like a mustard seed, stretch it out. You shall be healed in the name of Jesus Christ. Praise Master Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. Our Father God is worthy. Almighty God. Everlasting Savior. Is there no balm in Gilead? No medicine. Daddy wants Almighty God wants to give you divine medicine. Maybe the medicine they have been prescribed to you is not working. But Almighty God wants to give you divine medicine that will heal you, that will make you to stand up 
and glorify Almighty God. Praise Master Jesus, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. No, no physician there that they can they restore the earth. Father God wants to restore your health back to you. He wants you to be healthy. He wants you to be healthy. He wants you to be healthy. He wants to restore your health back to you. Please believe in him. Please don't doubt. Don't doubt. He's there where you are right now. Please don't doubt. He loves you. He's going through that pain that you are passing through there uh, right now. He touches him. Please. Don't doubt. You shouldn't doubt. Please. Stretch your faith out. Jesus Christ is there with you. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. God wants to restore your health. There is no Bami Gilead that I cannot rescue you that is it. There is Bami Gilead, the blood of Jesus. By the stripes of Jesus, we were healed. There is Bami Gilead that will heal you, the blood of Jesus Christ. He has paid for you, he has paid for me with his special blood. The Holy Spirit. Sweet Holy Spirit is there. God is able. God is able to heal you, my sisters, my brothers, wherever you are, in the hospital at home. God is able to, to heal you. All you have to do, stretch out your face. You will stand up by the grace of God. That you will go out there, you will testify the goodness of God. May the Lord bless you, servant of God. You will go out there, you will testify the goodness of God. You will testify that God has healed me. God sent me has servant. God has sent me. His servant. Her servant, sorry. God sent a servant to come and pray for me. Praise Master Jesus. Please release your release your faith. Stretch out your faith. It's there to heal you. Lord Jesus loves you. Lord Jesus Christ loves you. He wants to heal you. All you have to do. Have faith, trust in him, compassionate God. He pity you when he see you crying out there in that bed. Please stretch out your feet. He's there to hear you. Praise Master Jesus. He's here to hear you, please. I will pray for you. Please receive your healing. Don't doubt. Touch the master, Lord Jesus Christ. Touch his, the hem of his garment. Touch him by faith. Touch him by faith. May the Lord bless you. Amen. As I will pray for you before I start praying for you. I want to read the word of the Lord to you. Concerning, concerning unforgiveness. If you are out there, you are sick. Before I will pray for you, please, I want you to release anyone that have hurt you. Anyone that, you, that have sinned against you. That cause you grief. That when you remember the thing they have done to you. You don't even want to live on this earth anymore. You just want to leave this earth. Because the thing is paining you. Even though people see you. They see you, you are well. Everything is well with you. But to you yourself, you know all is not well. You know all is not well. Within you, all is not well. You got everything. But when you remembered what they have done to you, maybe relative, maybe neighbor, maybe friend, close friend, you trust, you trust that close, close friend so much, she betray you. It can be family member, it can be parents, or it can be your children. Please, I want you. Can be your pastor, can be your, your, your church member. When you remember what they have done to you, you are grieving, you, your spirit is squeezed tight because of that pain. Please, I come to tell you, before we pray for you, I want you to release them from your heart. Forgive them. I know it's painful, really painful. If I'm telling you that it's not painful, I am not saying the truth. It's the grace of God. I thank God for God. 
the grace of God. As Apostle Paul was asking the Father God, he was asking Father God, take this thing away from me, take this thing away from me. Father God said, no. My, 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 my grace is sufficient unto you. The grace of the Lord Almighty that was sufficient to all to, to, to you, Apostle Paul, is with you. Because you are a child of God as well. I am a child of God. His grace for you to forgive the one that hurt you is not by your strength, not by your power. Because if you said you would do it by your strength, you can never forgive. Because when the enemy know how he will trigger, pam. Before you knew about it, you are happy now. Before you knew about the enemy, we say, ah, she's happy. Oh, he's happy. Let us remind her. Let us remind him or her that name. As soon you heard about that name, oh, grief. Forgiveness is good for you. It's a great, a great medicine for you to forgive. All forgiveness is, is a, I, I don't know, is it rotting your bones. Many of if many people that seek, if you trace it out, you will see one person have hurt them. One person have done something to them to hurt them. Please, unforgiveness is not good. I know it's hard to forgive. But the grace of God, we give you. God, but but the grace of God, you will be able to release them from your from your mind, from your from your heart. God wants to hear you. As what God said in His Word, He said, "Forgive." The word of the Lord said in the book of He said, "The word of the Lord said, for you and I to forgive." I read the word of the Lord to encourage you wherever you are, my brothers, my sisters. That is grief. True, because what somebody has done to you. Please let me, let me read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Please for you to forgive the one that hurt you. Release them from your heart. Forgive them. Please, please forgive them. Lord Jesus Christ loves you. Father God loves you that he sent his precious son, Lord Jesus he left his throne to this earth to come and die for you and I. You and I, we, 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 we were a sinner. Or oh, some of you that haven't accept him as your Lord, your Savior, you are still a sinner. Until you are born again. Until you accept Jesus Christ as your Lord, your Savior. He that forgave us, he will give us the grace to forgive the one that hurt us. The word of the Lord said here in, my, in the book of Matthew chapter, in the book of Matthew chapter, chapter, chapter 11, 12. I read in Jesus' name. No, the book, the book of uh, Matthew, the book of Matthew chapter 6, verse 12. He said, and uh, forgive us our debt, our, our debt. And uh, we, I'm uh, sorry, as uh, we forgive our debtors, you see, the here is we are pray as Father Lord Jesus Christ taught us to pray that you are not we ask God Father forgive me my debt and my death as I forgive my debtors so you must forgive I must forgive even though the pain is too much God will hear that word God will hear that broken heart. God will, God will remote, they will remote and shape it again. For the joy of the Lord will reign in your heart, will reign in your life. That we see you hear the, about that person, you will not be grieved. Please, you are a Christian or you are not a Christian, please forgive. Forgiveness is every, for everyone. Forgiveness is for your good. When you forgive, it's for your good. You will have freedom. You don't have that grief anymore, that bitterness anymore. You remember what they did to you, but no grief anymore. No bitterness anymore. You can pray for them. You can ask God for mercy. You never know. As you forgive, as you forgive them, you never know God will use you to be a blessing to them. You never know that. I 
as you forgive them, God will use you to be a blessing to them. The prayer that you will start praying for them, you don't know if it, if it is your prayer that will make them to accept Jesus Christ as their Lord, their Savior. Forgiveness is very good. May the Lord give you the grace wherever you are. May the Lord give you the grace to forgive those that hurt you. Please, don't hold them in your heart. Don't hold them in your mind. Release them. God will heal that wound. God will replace joy instead of uh, grief, instead of bitterness in your heart. God will re re replace it. We take that bitterness away. Take that grief away. That, take that pain away. It will restore joy and the peace into you in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise Master Jesus. That is the word of the Lord today to encourage you. To encourage you, my sisters. To encourage you, my brothers. Please. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Forgive. Please forgive. Almighty God. Lord Jesus Christ loves you. Please have mercy on them. As God having mercy on you, have mercy on them as well. In Jesus' name. Amen. May the Lord bless you. In Jesus' name. I would like to sing to the glory of God. Praise Master Jesus. I would like to sing to the glory of God. Before I start, before I start singing, I know the rain is falling. Rain of blessing, rain of healing. Please receive your healing. Don't let this healing pass you by. Please. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Holy Spirit, move me now. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I make my life whole again. Spirit, move all over. Spirit move all over who Holy Spirit move me now I make my life whole again Spirit moon all over who Spirit move all over home. Holy Spirit move me now. And make my life whole again. Spirit move all over home. Spirit moon all over home. Spirit moon all over home. Holy Spirit move me now. I make my life whole again. Spirit moon. All of our hearts, spirit, moon, all of us, spirit, moon, all of our hearts, hallelujah.
the Lamb of God that we like to so pray right now please stretch your faith out and receive your healing stretch your faith out and receive your healing master Jesus master heal is with you right now stretch your faith out in Jesus name amen oh heavenly father the king of kings the lord of lord the ancients of the father you are beautiful you are excellent you are wonderful mighty God that do my faith in father there is no other God it's like you you are the most high God and I thank you for your sons I thank you for your daughter out there right now in the hospital at home that's sick right now father and I, you are the healer you are the healer you are the healer almighty God by the stripes of Jesus we were him heavenly father mighty God as you ask your question there is no if there is no Bami Gilead. Father, the blood of Jesus Christ is able. The blood of Jesus Christ is able to heal your sons and your daughter, Lord Jesus Almighty God. Oh Lord, my Father, let your healing rain shower right upon your sons and your daughters. Wherever they are in the hospital, I hope Father God told them. Let your healing rain flow from your throne room, Almighty God, and wash your sons and your daughter's sickness and diseases away, Father. And it's not your way for your children to be sick. It's not your way your children are going through this pain and this pain, crying every time when the pain is hurting us so much. Oh Lord, my Father, you want to heal them. Oh Lord, you want to restore good health and back to them. You want to restore their health and back to them, oh Lord. Oh Lord, my Father, heal your children. Wherever they are, Father, touch them, oh Lord. But then let your healing rest shower upon them. Let your mighty holy healing run rest upon them right now in the name of Jesus. But then let them stand up in the name of Jesus Christ and do what they couldn't do before, my God. But I be with your children, oh Lord. But I heal them, oh Lord. You are our healer. Oh Lord Jesus, heal your children. King of glory, heal your children. Ancients of the heal them in the name of Jesus, Christ, my Father. And I heal them, O oh Lord. And I, you are the compassionate God, Father, heal your children. And I let your mighty hand rest upon them right now in the name of Jesus, Christ, my Father. And as you have said, according to your word, Almighty God, you said you have given, you have given me the kingdom. The keys of burning and losing. Whatsoever I burn on this earth shall be burned in the heavens. Whatsoever shall be burned in the heaven. Whatsoever I lose on this earth shall be lost in the heaven, Father, my Lord. But I, 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 I receive the power now, now, mighty God, now, almighty God. I receive that power. I receive that key right now, mighty God. In the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus that I come against. You spirit of foul, you foul spirit. You, 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 you foul spirit, you demons of death and you death, death and dumb. In the name of Jesus Christ, I command you. Not to lose your whole out of the children of God. Lose your whole in the name of Jesus. Christ. Get out of the children of God. You do foul spirit. Get out of the children of God. In the name of Jesus. Christ. The children of God body belong to Jesus. Their, their body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. You sickness and disease you cannot dwell in this body. Their body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. Their body belongs to Jesus. You sickness and disease you cannot dwell in there. In the name of Jesus. Christ. I command every arrows of infirmity. The fire against the children of God. In the name of Jesus. I command you to come out and rose to watch in them every arrows of infirmities fire and against the children of God I command you by the power of the authority of my Lord Jesus Christ. I command those arrows all those arrows come out and rose to watch in the name of Jesus arrows of witchcraft arrows of occultism arrows of Mary spirit arrows of occultism and the Mary spirit demons fire and against the children of God arrows of sickness and disease I command you in the name of Jesus come out of the children of God come out in the name of Jesus come out in the name of Jesus come out in the name of Jesus, come out in the name of Jesus and rose to watch in the name because the body of the children of God belong to Jesus. Their body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. No, as the Father God said, their body, our body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. Any power, any man that defy the body, they shall destroy them. As you, you powers of darkness, try to defy the body of the children of God through sickness and diseases. My God shall destroy you. 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 In the name of Jesus, lose your hold. Lose your hold. Lose your grip. Lose your hold. Lose your Part of the children of God say in the middle. Who the son of God set free straight in. By the stripes of Jesus we are here. By the stripes of Jesus we are here. I am the Lord that he led it. I am the Lord that he led it. Take your bag and bag it. Pack your bag and bag it. Get out of the children of God say. You sickness and disease. I cause your root in the name of Jesus. I cause your root in the name of Jesus. You sickness and disease in the body of the children of God say. I cause your root in the name of Jesus. Come out of their life. Come out with all your root. You sickness and disease. Come out with all your root. Out of the children of God say. Come 
come out by fire, come out by fire, not thunder. Come out with all your roots, come out with all your roots, come out of their lives in the name of John. A rose sweat in the be rose sweat in the be rose sweat in the Greater I say that is in them, the heat that is in the water. No weapon that form against them shall prosper. Every tongue that rise up against them in their judgment, I utterly condemn right in the I utterly condemn every tongue that rise up against that, my sisters, my dad, and brother, 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 right now, that sick right now. I come against every tongue that rise up against you. I command those tongues to be, to be condemned in the name of Jesus. Man. I said, stand up in the name of Jesus and walk. Stand up and release it. Receive your name. You that daughter, so you that daughter, and, do and sons of God. Stand up to that, to, to, to that bed. Receive your healing. In the name of Jesus. Man. Receive your healing. By faith, receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Re healing, rain is showering from the throne room of God. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Wherever you, you are. In the east, in the west, in the north, in the south. Receive your healing. I said, receive your healing. Rain healing, rain is showering. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. And stand up and glorify the Lord Almighty. Receive your healing. And testify the goodness of God in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. In the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. In the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. In the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. In Jesus' name. Who the Son of God set free is strengthened. I swear that God said in His word. As the Father God said in his word, if he be for us, if God be for us, who can be against us? God is with you, my sister. God is with you, my 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 brothers. God is with you, my mommy, my dad is wherever you are. God is with you. If my God be with for you, who can be against you? If my God be for you, who can be against you? Oh, you are more than conqueror. I am more than conqueror. True Christ who loves us. And we are more than conqueror. Stand up and walk. Stand up and receive, receive your feeling. In the name of Jesus. Receive your healing by faith. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. You are complete in our Lord Jesus. We are complete in our Lord Jesus Christ, which is the head of all principality and powers. Oh, Father, my Lord, I thank you for healing your children. I thank you, Father. You are our healer. You are our healer. Thank you for your healing rain that shall upon your children. Now watch your children's body, the body that belongs to you. The body, your, our body is the temple of the Holy Ghost. Thank you for your healing your children. In the east, in the west, in the north, in the thousand. Thank you for for your healing or your sons and your daughter. Thank you, everlasting Father. You are worthy, Lord. You are mighty, Lord. You are a son, Lord. Wonderful Jehovah. Wonderful Redeemer. You are worthy. Our healer. You are worthy. Our healer. Our master. Master Jesus. We bless you. We thank you, Lord. Greater is you that is in us. The he that is in the world. Thank you, Lord. All powers belong to you in the name of Jesus. Father God, any power, any spirit, any personality that want to attack me spiritually, physically because of this prayer. Oh, Lord. Lord, my Father, that thou let your thunder fire rise and consume them. Let your power, let your thunder fire rise and consume your power wherever they are. On the air, on the land, on the sea, under the sea, wherever they are. In the first heaven, the second heaven, fire of the Holy Ghost. Locate them and burn them to achieve in the name of Jesus. Right? Greater is he that is in me, that he that is in the world. It is straight in turn, no man, not a child. Do my prophet no harm. I know who I call upon. I know as I am. Mean. As my Father God said in his word, the rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the righteous. I am a righteous gentle child of God in Christ Jesus. No weapon that form against me shall prosper. Oh Lord, my Father, I give you the glory. I give you the honor. I give you the praise, oh Lord, for healing your sons and your daughter right now. For healing your children. You are our healer. But I take all the glory. But I take all the honor. And I take all the praise. I cover them. I cover my sisters, my brother, right now. Wherever they are right now. I cover them by the precious blood of Jesus. Man. I cover their healing with the blood of Jesus. Man. I cover their healing with the precious blood of Jesus. Man. Father, God. God, I thank you for the spirit recovery that you gave to them, Almighty God. You are worthy, Lord. Thank you, everlasting Father. I thank you for each and every, every one of them. I bless your holy name, Lord. Your name alone shall be glorified in their lives, in our lives, in Jesus. Say, take all the glory, take all the honor, take all the praise, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. I thank God for your life. My sisters, my brother, thank God for your life. I am happy for you. Jesus Christ have healed you. Our healer, our healer, our healer. We serve a mighty God. We serve a mighty God. We serve a mighty God. We bless the name of the Lord. Spirit recovery unto you in Jesus' name. Amen. Please, my sisters, my brother, wherever you are, my mommies, my daddies, wherever you are, 
Pay please if you don't have Jesus Christ as your Lord, your Savior, as He has healed you right now. It's our is this He is His goodness that brought us to prepare us. Please, I want you to give your life to Jesus. The same Jesus Christ that's, that healed you right now, the same Jesus Christ wants to save you. So He wants you when you finish on this earth to come and meet Him. He loves you. He prepared a place for you, waiting for you, for you to come and come and come and come and enjoy with him from everlasting to everlasting when you finish on this earth. Please accept him as your Lord, your Savior. Please don't 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 say tomorrow or later or let me think about it. Please. Now is the salvation. Now salvation are come. Now please receive Jesus and be born again. As the Lord, the Lord Jesus Christ said, a certain man is born again. A certain man is be born again. You must be born again. I must be born again. For you are not to seek kingdom of God, for you and I to spend our eternity with Father God, we must be born again. That means you and I must accept Jesus Christ as our Lord, your Savior. We must make him our Lord. We must give him our soul, our, our life. We must surrender to him. We must say, Lord, you are my you are my Lord. I surrender myself, I surrender my will unto your power, unto your, unto your, I give you my life. Use me for the purpose that you created me for. He will use it for his whole glory in the name of your place. I want you to give your life to Jesus. Don't procrastinate. Please, please, please give, give your life to Jesus. He wants to save you. He hid you. He wants to save you because one day, one day we will leave this. Uh, we are a trader here. When we finish trading, we are going to our master to go and uh, give a report, to go and uh, give uh, our account. So every one of us will give an account to, to Jesus. Oh my God. On that day, he's our judge. He's our, he's our, he's our judge. He's the one that will judge every one of us. You don't say because and uh, that this your, uh, this your, uh, uh, Jesus Christ you are talking about. You said he's the one that will judge. Uh, and that day when I will close my eye in there, I will not even near him. I will not go there. No, 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 no. You will be there. No, you will be there. Every one of us will be there. You like it or no? You being a Christian, you don't mean a Christian. You said you are a Muslim or you are Buddhist or you are Hindu or you are atheist. Name them. The name you call it just name them on that day every name every tongue we confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. You cannot say you we not. You don't even have the power. You don't even have the mouth to say you cannot be there. Immediately the person closes that. Immediately you are you are landing the in the front of Almighty God. He's judging all of us. It's because of that. Please give your life to Jesus. He will it will do you good on this earth. And when you finish on this earth, it will do you good. It will do you good because there are two eternity: heaven eternity, hell fire eternity. Please. Hellfire is not a place for you to go. Please don't don't even think about it. Say, ah, this hellfire they are talking about, I want to go there. You cannot be able to stand it. It's torment, fire, no no food, no drink, nowhere to sleep. Standing, make uh, um, fire cover the person like a blanket from everlasting to everlasting. And the demons, they are, they are punishing the one that is in there. The one that is in the hellfire, they didn't accept Jesus Christ as, a, as their Lord and Savior. They reject, they reject Lord Jesus Christ. When they, when they, when they heard about Jesus Christ, they, no, 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 they don't want to, they don't want to, anything to do with your Lord Jesus Christ. But when they die, now they are regretting. Even though now they are accepting Jesus Christ in, in the hellfire, it makes no sense anymore. It makes no sense anymore. Instead of them to do it here, when you and I have the, have the opportunity to do it before somebody closing, their eyes, our eyes in them, we receive Jesus, we accept Jesus Christ and our Lord our Savior. Please give him your life. He loves you so much. He doesn't want you to perish. Please. He wants you. He loves you. Jesus Christ loves you. Please give him. Please give him your life. He loves you so much. Give him your life. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. In Jesus' name. Please, I would like to pray for you. I would like to pray for you. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah, my friend. This thing was just flying off to you. Oh, sorry. Just pack my, my papers. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. <laughs> Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Please, I would like to. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. Please, I would like to, 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 to pray for you. Accept Jesus Christ as your Lord, your Savior, please. Jesus Christ loves you. He wants you to spend eternity with him, please. Don't refuse. Don't refuse this offer. Please, give him your life. Pray after me. Amen. The salvation prayer. Pray after me in Jesus' name. Amen. Dear God, I am a sinner. I need forgiveness. 
I believe that Jesus Christ shed his precious blood for me and then died for my sin. I am willing to turn from sin. I am I now invite Jesus Christ to come into my heart as my personal savior. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. May the Lord bless you. I am happy for you. May the Lord bless you. Angels of the Lord, they are rejoicing over your soul right now. They are rejoicing over you because you have come up. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, glory. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. They are rejoicing right now for you, accepting Jesus Christ as your Lord, your Savior. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord let His face shine upon you. I welcome you in the body of Christ in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. I'm happy for you. I am happy for you. Really happy for you in Jesus. If the Lord Almighty God, Lord Jesus Christ comes today to call, to collect all His children, you will be one of them that we will allow that we go up and then meet, uh, meet our Lord Jesus Christ on the air. What a joy. What a joy that day will be. That you and I will see each other in heaven. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Please, please buy Holy Bible. Buy Holy Bible. Be reading the word of the Lord. God, we, God Almighty, our Savior, our Redeemer. Almighty God will review. God he will continue review himself to you holy spirit we continue teaching you you start understanding the scripture gradually by the grace of god in jesus name please uh, look for the bible church i know that the, the, the church that teach on the little word of god they are few may the lord lead you to the to, to to one of them in the name of jesus christ please tell your pastors that you you want a water baptism because father lord jesus christ did it and he said you and uh, all his children we should do it we should baptize as he baptized, he wants us to do this, the same. Tell them that you want a battle for them to make a water baptism for you. It is my prayer. Oh, your pastors, we have the time to make that water baptism for you. In Jesus' name, amen. May the, may the Lord bless you. Remain blessed in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you in the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord let His face continue shining upon you and your family in the name of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ loves you. You are bringing joy to His heart every day when He sees you. Joy, joy. Hallelujah. Okay, we can hardly wait to see that precious day we will see our maker, our savior, our redeemer. That he will embrace you, embrace me, lift us up. He said, my daughter, you made it, we made it. Ah, can see the reward that is waiting for you and I. Oh, Lord Jesus, we bless the name of the Lord in Jesus. The virtuous man, please. Jesus Christ depends on you, depend on me. Please let us go at them. Let us continue on evangelizing Jesus. Now you cannot go out. Now we cannot go out for evangelism, but you can take your, 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 you can take your, what is it called? Your telephone. You can just uh, test uh, Just send something. Send message. Message about Jesus loves you, my sister. Repent, my brother. Send message. Send message. Please, if you can share this message, just share message to them. Share them a good message that preach at the sound doctrine that preach about the holiness and righteousness. Send that message to them. Let them read. Let them listen by the grace. So if it is a, a, a scripture, a scripture you want to just uh, snap them and uh, snap them and post it. Just send it out. Let us continue doing it. God will reward you greatly in the name of Jesus. Now you will not labor in vain. I will not labor in vain in the name of your virtuous man. Let us continue and evangelize Jesus Christ to the dying world. Let us run fast. And we should not be we should not keep our mouth shut. The enemy out there, you can see what is going on. We don't know the day our master is coming. Let us run fast. Let us walk. Let us as we are walking for him. I'm sorry, as we are walking with him, let us walk for him. Let us walk for him. Hallelujah. Glory, glory, hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Please, my sister, that's my brother. Please, I would like you to take a ball pen and a piece of paper. I want to take the, call some uh, scripture to you. Please sit down quietly and read it for yourself. It is my prayer. God will speak to you. Holy Spirit, we, we give you the understanding of his word. Open your, uh, your, your heart of understanding to understand it for you to obey him. And uh, give this script. If you can give the uh, send this uh, scriptures uh, to your sisters or your friends, uh, your relative, co-worker, the one you can able to share it. 
Joshua, just send it to them. Let them read it, read it because this is the word of the Lord. It's not you that make it up. It's not me that make it up. It's the word of the Lord. It's the word of the Lord. You and I, everyone on this earth will be judged with. It's the word of the, the word of the Lord. The scripture, the Holy Scripture. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I call, I call it for you. The book of Psalm, the book of Psalms, one hundred and thirty-five, verse fifteen. The book of Deuteronomy 7, 25 to 26. The book of uh, Isaiah 30, 22. The book of uh, Isaiah 31, 7. The book of uh, Deuteronomy 22, 5. The book of Jeremiah 4, 30. The book of uh, Second King uh, nine and nine thirty. The book of uh, Ezekiel twenty three forty. The book of Revelation twenty one verse eight. The book of Revelation twenty fifteen. The book of uh, First uh, Cor First Corinthians eleven. First condition 11, verse 5 to 6. Praise Master Jesus. Please read it quietly. It is my prayer. No Holy Spirit is with you. Holy Spirit, we explain to you. Give you the understanding of the word of the Lord. Obedience is better than the sacrifice. You don't say, because now I'm doing the things, I'm doing things in the house of God. That qualify me to make heaven. No, it's not because you are doing the work in the house of God that, that qualifies you to make heaven. What qualifies you and I to make heaven is obedient to the word of God. For you obey him, total obedience. Obey him and living a holy life righteous. I said, don't do this, don't do it. He said, do this, do it. That is what qualify you and I. By the blood of Jesus Christ, by the grace of Jesus, by the grace of Almighty God. Please, I want you to read it for yourself. As a woman, see, I see dressing, says it dressing, open your chest, open your back for people to see. Pushing your breast out, half of the breast is seen. Please, you are offending your maker. Not just only offending your maker, you are making the, the, the children and the, the sons of God. So far, because of your puppy, your breast uh, half open, half breast open, back open, you are making them to lost after you falling after you after they see your you uh, how you 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 present yourself. You say you are a, child, a daughter of God. Present yourself going to church or going somewhere else, dress half naked, and men are lost in after you when they finish seeing you. They will go in their closets. What they are doing, they start masturbating. They are doing it in the spiritual and they are doing it with you. If you like it, if you know it or not. Please dress modestly as a woman. Don't dress, don't put on trousers as a woman. As the word of the Lord said, we as a woman, we should dress modestly, holy. That we should not put what pertains to man on. If you go to the public toilet, it's not somebody that telling you this is for man, and this is for woman. Immediately you see the sign there, you know this is for woman. This is for, this is for man. Praise Master Jesus. You see when you see the 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 military in the military people, you see the army people, you see the the, the, the what's it called the police people. You see them by their uniform. You, you know them by their uniform. This is a police person. This is a navy and a navy person. This is a, you know, if you see the daughters, you know, this is with their uniform. Ah, this is daughter, you know, in the hospital. I'm talking the daughter in the hospital. So you recognize them immediately. You see the one that they said they are dying for few football team. They use their, these their trickles they are using to recognize them. This is what they belong to. Where did this is where they belong to? Where this is where this one belong to. You are now as a child of God. We belong to Jesus. As he said, we should dress modestly. As a woman, you are going to, to interview. Or you are going to not just only women and men as well. Going to interview just say worldly things. You are going there, you dress proper properly. 
But when you are coming to the house of God, you dress half naked. God and the dear one that want to give you job, who is greater? God is greater. Why can't you honor your God? Dress modesty as he said, we as a woman, we should dress modesty. Virtuous women. Praise Master Jesus. In and out must be clean. Don't say that uh, God is answering my prayers. I am a prophetess. I am a pastor. I am a minister of God. God is answering my prayer. Even though I'm dressing, I'm naked. Even, I know, even though I'm putting all those uh, just Jezebel property, the ring, the chain, the, the makeup, the tattoos, uh, the, the eyelashes, fake eyelashes, fake nails, uh, um, lipstick, facing my facing hair, and uh, putting wig, uh, wool, and attachment on your hair. When you die, you will go to heaven. You are joking. You are just joking. You are lying to yourself. You are lying to yourself. Because all those things belong to, to, to Satan. All those things belong to the, 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 the... Those things are called Jezebel properties. Jezebel properties will not enter heaven. God will not let Jezebel property enter heaven. It's only Jezebel woman that make up, make up her, her face, her paint her face in the, in, the, in the word of God. No other woman. Please, you are a daughter of a in the daughter of Sarah. Please, daughter of Zion, dress modesty. Please take those gold and those silver, those chains out of your neck, out of your hands. Ring is ring. Wedding ring, call it ring. Ring is ring. Please, get, give them off. Don't let those things take a heaven away from you. Don't know that they God will call you. Please, get rid of those things. Stop bleaching your skin. Stop lying. When you are breaking, breaching your skin, you are a liar. Because you are, you, are, you, are, you are presenting yourself fake to other people. Today you are, you, are, you, are, you are white. Tomorrow you are black. You see? You are lying to yourself. You lie to people. You lie to God. You lie to everyone. Please repent and stop bleaching your skin. Leave your skin as God created it for you. And he created you finished said you are good. He created you finished said beautiful. We are fearfully and wonderfully made. You are for God. Why now you are going bleaching your skin? Perming your, perming your hair, stretching your hair out with the realizer. You are telling God, this is my glory. I don't like it. Because your hair is your glory. As soon as you are you putting all this uh, attachment, uh, the wig, all this thing, putting wool on this thing on your hair, you are defying your glory. You are defying your glory. The pin, the one that they're putting on the wig, they said, uh, uh, it's my hair. It's my hair. They claim me the word of God is sin. You see? You are saying, telling them, they say, ah, this is my, it's my glory. My hair is my glory. But you are putting on fake thing on your hair. You put in a wig that is not yours. You don't know where they made that wig. The dead people that they used their, their, that they took their hair and they used it to make uh, those a uh, wig. Do you know how they live? Do you know the spirit they, they have? You know, some of them, they are using their hair, they sacrifice their hair to idol. And when they burn it, they, they, they crave their hair, they use it to make a sacrifice for idol, and they will wash it and they come and sell it for you. And they are putting an idol thing in your, you don't know where those things come from. You are defying your hair. Your hair is your glory as a woman, please. Your hair is your glory. Please don't put on those things. Please stop your perfume, perf packing the perfume on your, on your body. If you, if you Google, it, Google it out, all those perfumes, and most of the per perfume you are buying, Google it out, you will see all those ones that, that are making it out, you will see many of them, they are in all courts. They are in all courts. They have a cast spell on it. Because of that, when you wear it, they are, when you pass somebody, they will tell you, what do you wear? Because that is not your smell. You are wearing somebody else's smell. What the sin they are doing, that sin is with you. Please stop it. Stop packing perfume on your body. Wearing high heel as a woman, please stop it. If you are wearing high heel, you see, just watch out the one that wearing high heels, how they walk. They walk like man made. They are not walking straight. They walk like man made. And you are not a man made. Please stop wearing high heels. Please stop it. It's, it's not for your good. Please. Praise Master Jesus. It is my prayer as you are hearing the word of the Lord. Please hear the word and obey. It's the obedient. 
is the one that will get you and I to heaven. Obey total obedience unto Almighty God. Please. Please. Tell God if you, you fight him to, to get those things out, get, tell God to give you the grace. Because it's not, God doesn't want you to miss heaven. He doesn't want to miss you. He wants you to spend eternity with him. But he don't want anything that will stop you on that day for you not to not to go to the to not for you not to enter the the the, the poly gate. He don't want anything to stop you. He don't want the enemy who says, so, 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 you are wearing my property. Give me my property. And as soon as you want to give that property, the, the enemy will say, it's not here you collect my, this property. You didn't get it here. It's the earth you got it. But now you cannot go to the earth. You are, de you are dead already. It's just your, soul have been doing. your soul is the one that is standing right now in the presence of the enemy. What the enemy is doing, he will claim that person's soul. And when he claims that person's soul, where is that person going? Hellfire. That will not be your portion. That will not be my portion. Please give it up. You can live without uh, the makeup. You can live without putting on a lipstick. You can live without no, uh, perming perm your hair with realizer. Without dyeing your hair, perming uh, coloring your You can live without not putting wig on your hair. You can live without you don't you don't pen, you don't put a contest on your nail. And sniff and uh, fake uh, fake eyelash and nails, uh, fake eyelashes. You can live without it. You can live Without a, or, or, your, your body half naked, cover yourself. You can live without me as a woman, not putting on trousers. Praise Master Jesus. Let us honor our Father, Almighty God. It's for your good, it's for my good. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. May the Lord bless you. As you are hearing the word of the Lord, please put it in practice. I should put it in practice. Please don't lie. Big lie, big lie, small lie, all of them are equal in the sight of God. He do not say because you lie small, you lie big lie. So I will spare the small one. No, lie is lie in the sight of God. Please, if you see have that spirit of lies, that you open your mouth, every second word that coming out is lie. Ask God to forgive you. He's ready to forgive you. He want to save your soul. Please stop lying. Stop lying. Stop lying. Lie will not favor you. Lie will cause ruin to somebody. Everlasting ruin. Everlasting destruction. Lie will cause. Please stop it. Ask God for mercy. Uh, ask God to give you the grace not to lie. When you fall, you see, you tumble to lie, immediately repent. As the person, the person you like to correct it immediately to that person. Call that person, make restitution immediately. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord let his face shine upon you. In Jesus' name. I love you all with the love of God. May the Lord bless you all. In Jesus' name. Amen. Shalom, shalom, shalom. Amen. Amen, amen. Blessings and glory.